Posting an article to a news group is just like sending an email, except everyone that subscribes to that news group will be able to read it. This video will walk you through the process with four of the most popular news clients, Newsbin Pro, Outlook Express, Thunderbird, and Unison. You can skip ahead in the video to the time shown on your screen for the news client you'll be using. If you want to use a different news client than those we have featured, we still recommend watching at least one of the videos, as posting among different news clients is pretty similar. In the left pane of Microsoft Outlook Express, select the news group you want to post to. Click the New Post button. Type the subject and body of your post. If you want to post to multiple news groups, click the News Groups button to select more, or manually enter the name of the news group in the News Groups field. If you'd like to attach a file, select Attach. Browse for the file you'd like to attach, and click Attach. When your post is complete, Click the Send button. And that's it! You successfully posted an article to Usenet. Right-click on the news group that you want to post to, and select Post to Group. Enter the subject and email address you want to display with your post. If you decide to use your real email address, make sure you enter your address with some fake details to protect against spam. Human readers will know to remove a portion of the displayed address to contact you. If you want to post to more than one news group, enter the names of the news groups into the Groups field. Next, enter the body of your post. If you would like to add an attachment, click Add Files and browse for the attachment you would like to upload. When your post is complete, click the Post Now button at the bottom of the window. And that's it! You successfully posted an article to Usenet. In the main window of Thunderbird, click on the news group that you want to post to and select Write from the top menu. This will bring up the Compose screen. Your username and reply to email address should auto-populate. If they don't, go ahead and enter them in the From field. If you'd like to post this message to more than one news group, enter the name of the news group manually in the News Group field, or click the down arrow to select from the list of available groups. Next, enter the subject and body of your post. When your post is complete, click Send. And that's it! You successfully posted an article to Usenet. From the main window of Unison, select the news group you'd like to post to. The news group will load, showing all the available messages. You can click on Post to start a new thread, or you can select a message and click Reply to respond to the selected messages. If you choose Post, this screen will appear. Enter the username and email address you want to display with your post. If you decide to use your real email address, make sure you enter your address with some fake details to protect against spam. Human readers will know to remove a portion of the displayed address to contact you. Now you can add the subject and body of your post, and when you're done, hit the Send button at the top of the screen. If you chose the Reply button, you'll get a screen that looks like this. Enter your name and email and the subject and body of your post to reply to another user's post. When you're done, hit the Send button. If you'd like to upload a file to the group, you can choose the Upload button. Type in a description of what you're uploading and hit the plus sign to browse your computer for the item you want to upload. When you're finished selecting your files, hit the Upload button to post your files to the news group. And that's it! You successfully posted an article to Usenet. 